How's it going, everybody? It's your boy, Walkie Talk Games here, bringing you another episode of The Walking Dead. I know it's been a while since my last upload, and I'm sorry about that, but today I'm bringing you guys some more videos of it. I want to thank you all for the like and support you guys have been giving me. And with that being said, let's get started. All right, let's go ahead and read this map of Clementine and figure hey, out a plan. Clint. Hi. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're gonna do when we Kinda get there. Kind of curious to see what you're wanting to talk about. Probably to something to do with your parents. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, still haven't told her you know, that we're they're team, possibly you know? dead. The team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. But I'm still gonna go ahead with Kenny's plan, plan on the I boat like because it. that still sounds like the best <laughs> idea out of this situation. Instead of running through the streets, finding someone that's possibly help find dead, a boat and not best find them at all. Safety. Okay, but we'll be in Savannah, and my parents were in Savannah. I know. Look. No, I don't care about safety. I care about finding them. Well, I care about safety, especially yours. Okay, we'll look for them. You're my responsibility. Really? Yes, of course. I'm sorry. Let's look at the map. But if I'll still help you try and find them if we have we the time. Start there. Okay, let's. I'm not going to break my Looks promise. Like we'll I'm come just right not going to go running through the streets. Well, I do when there's to walkers all over the place. Here, I imagine. And from there, we've got all the savannah to the southwest of us. Now we've got a well, that doesn't really exactly what do you think? give us an opening on same place when where we go to go it's, to look for our parents. Uh, hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, come on, Clem. A lot of hotels you gotta know here, what the hotel this map is. Maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the M. Great, that's why you remember. M something. Oh, M. Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it. Days and often so we'll distance, there. not even looking at yes. the map. You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know. I don't really think that's a good idea, but sure. I mean, at this point, it doesn't really matter. Everybody else sure. knows. Go ahead. All right. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good I'm little I'm glad you're happy that we have Thanks. a plan. I guess we should but see how no, far. Oh, shit! Hold on, everybody! Okay, what's going on now? I feel like this is not going to be a good situation. He looks angry. <laughs> okay, that's that's a fair reason to be angry. I would be annoyed too. Fuck, 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 fuck! Maybe we could walk? That's fucking stupid. It looks stupid. like Kenny has lost his mind. I'm just saying. He has finally hmm. snapped. I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. Thing's not full of milk. Oh yeah, that's Charles. a good idea. That's gas or diesel, something that's going to explode. Exactly. You don't even you know what could be yourself. in it. You gotta always think of the here. scenario that there might be something explosive this in there. Shit. This. Yo, you keep screaming like that, and you're gonna oh, get your face like chewed gonna throw off. Hands you guys gonna be trouble? Those two didn't break because it up. we could have just kept walking. No, we're friendly. I'm gonna try starting it off friendly. I don't want to be hostile with them, but they don't you know. seem Let's get these guys a break. We'll see. to be aggressive right now. You guys now, got a problem with your train? You can't yeah. be safe. With You're these standing right in front of it, dude. It's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there, we won't let them escape. I mean, I don't really blame them, but you also gotta think of the fact there are safety in numbers at this point. If I come up there, and people you do, better not be murderers or thieves. I guess the end of the world, and out. more and more people will just go into the side of killing people and not Google try not even what we need. They're what you survive think together. We need. We're doing fine for now. What about when? Stop it. Hey, dude, I'm Omid. Lee. Crystal. They were arguing about What's the deal something. With the train? We're driving it. Oh man. 
We could use some good people. That's not. That's you want to help us out? We could use some able bodies. It's been a yeah, really we, we crappy really situation so far. For What's us. in it? Oh shit! God damn, you guys have a kid. Oh, so he gets to swear. What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Oh, this is yeah, great. Thank you, Lee. See, things are looking up. You're not her dad. I he try and there? make it's that obvious. I don't try and swear as much no, as possible in front of you, Clementine. There. He just gets to huh. up in front and do whatever story? he wants. How's that fair? I came across I'll be honest Clementine with alone. Like it's gonna First day all of this happened. I was actually incarcerated. Sick. Do you have any prison tats? I, no. Uh, didn't make it that far. And everybody down there. I don't think Lee has cool. any tattoos at all. Kenny lost his wife and kid. Man, how long ago? What time is it? Uh, I don't know, uh, four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. We're I feel like it was the best guys. option to the tell them about awesome, Kenny's though. story so a they know real problem. We'll why he's it, being so snappy and aggressive like. with people. We're That's how he comes off. I don't want them to think he does. We'd appreciate the help. Screw them over Can't or just something. blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, no, it's full of gas. The rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. So far, she's the only one that has an idea, so... Let's go ahead and check this truck real quick before we go down. You can find almost anything useful anywhere. That's about the oh only God, useful take. thing in here. Go figure. Alright, well that seems to be about it. Alright, so let's go down and check on the group. Talk to him. Tell him about the plan. Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes. Like I said, we could use some good people. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we are not looking for charity. The plan is to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Seems like plan enough to me. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get Hold to know the right now, you agree, so that's, that's good. And why don't I show you how this thing works? In case something happens. Really, Ken? It's probably for the best. You are really Someone going Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. You just think something's going to happen to you. You interrogating this mean, woman for us. He's pretty much lost his entire she family. Set off any alarm lost all his faith. Not yet. She's very thorough. That's what I like to hear. Hey there. All right. That's a pretty I want to talk to her a bit her and then talk to Omid a bit. I want to see it's more busted, about them. But it means something to her. Oh, but I don't want to make them feel careful. like we're trying She's to a crack shot now. You not got trust them. I want to be careful Look, with my choices like here. You weren't getting one. It's good. She should be able to take care of herself. Where are you from? San Francisco. Jeez. Long way from home. I blame the one in there. He wanted the great American road trip. Well, he got a little more than he bargained for, huh? Who the hell is into Civil War history anyway, other than old white guys? Wonderful. You two will be thick as thieves. I guess we will. Not sure how we'll get that tank down. Maybe ask Omid. He likes to break things. Time go talk with old Mead. You like Civil War history, huh? Fuck yeah. What do you know about some Quantrill's raid? Well, yeah, it happened about a thousand miles that way. Well, yeah. And we're headed the other way. But if it's somehow not crawling with the dead, there should be some cool things to see. Excellent. Don't tell Krista, though. That won't be as big a selling point for her. You got it. <laughs> Learning the ropes. Right, cool. So we found out too hard, he likes right? a little bit of history for a lot of levers I can't wait to use. I said if something uh, were. So he's pretty chill. Me. He's a little bit more we can drive in laid sheds. back and open and talk we'll to see. us than Krista. How have you two made it this far? You seem dangerously normal. Krista doesn't let us join groups. And I'm a fucking scrapper. 
I got the feeling she takes care. Maybe you scrap her by highly down and sell your own. I've well. saved her ass hundreds, tens, sometimes. Exactly. How long since you've been home? Like six months. We were on the road for a while, and then, you know. That's rough. Her cat is gonna be pissed. Talk to you later. I don't know what that does yet. Don't touch it. I said don't touch it, jackass. And now he's just trying to irritate Kenny. That's probably not the best idea, my guy. Probably not the best idea at all. At least Chuck sings in I'm good spirits. He's, he's still playing his spirit. guitar. By, I don't know. He could just like music. He could just like playing. Probably to kill time. I mean, I don't blame him. Got a clear view Not up really there? Much they can do. Yeah, we're good for a ways. Thank God. We need someone, anyone, to come along and and yeah, like that's gonna happen. Or something. That's not gonna happen. Get used to them. I don't so think they're going anywhere anytime to soon. Well, their numbers keep going up. You. And ours. I'm telling you, Lee, if they ever get a hold of me, and I know I'm not getting out of it, that's it, man. I'm just gonna punch my own ticket. Punch your own ticket? Yeah. Take myself out. Don't be dramatic. I swear, he's... And don't let them get a hold. I don't know about Ben anymore at this point. He seems okay in episode two, but now it's like the more he she progresses into this life with us, he becomes more and more of a coward. I don't know. He just doesn't seem to want to put his work in to survive or here? deal with the like walkers the or do, scavenge or anything. It's like we're a team, in my opinion, like at said. least. Yeah. All right. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. All right. Now we're at the station. This Somebody doesn't look good already. Saying there are survivors inside, I feel like there might be some walkers. My worriedness on here is how many inside. You should wait for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Uh, luckily, it's locked. We'll get better at working together. The window's open up there. Maybe I could look in? <clears throat> mm, won't budge. Of course. Hey, why don't I put you on my shoulders you might have you can peek into that window up there? Sounds good. <clears throat> okay, I can see in. What do I do now? What do you see? Lots of crates and stuff. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock, which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. For real? I think so. Well then. Well, I'll be damned. You may have actually just done good for once. Let's go. Be careful. No, I can't I'm say that. She's to actually. Tell you that. She's just now learning to survive on her own, so I can't say that. That's a little bit of Lee's fault for not teaching her how to survive earlier. That and she is pretty small and just a kid still, so she can only do so much. Here. I can't. Maybe give I can hold the name. door open. I don't like that. I'll prop it open at some. Could I possibly look around or no? Okay. I guess I'll just have to leave my weapon there. I really don't feel comfortable with that. 
Why does this feel like it's all setting up to be a really bad decision about to happen? I really don't like this. That's exactly what we need. Over there? Yeah, we need to get in there and get that blowtorch. Locked up good. There are keys over there. For the gate? I hope so. I don't know. This is just all. There's some space up there. Really, really. Much. We're lucky and so little. Make me feel are. like this is gonna be something bad happening. I don't know about you guys, but that's you okay that's going I'm over the top of this. this fence? Yeah, definitely. The keys are on the opposite wall. Grab them and let's get this gate open. <laughs> oh yeah, playing her behind a locked cage. This is all keys, lining up to be something really bad for a plot choice. Come on, scoot. I don't like that look. Behind you! I knew it. Fuck. Great, now I don't got a gun. That's a real good You see, dude, let's just toss the gun under the fence. This will work so much better than the contract. I would prefer you getting off me. Well, you lost half your jaw. Do you feel better now? You lost half it's your okay, jaw. It's okay. Everything's fine. More? Keys, now! This was a really stupid idea. Fuck, it's still locked! Well, no, no shit, it's still locked. I, I was trying to grab the keys, Lee. It showed him having his gun. When I didn't have my gun. <laughs> God, damn. That don't make sense. It didn't go so good. No, it did not go so good. But we're okay. Everything's okay. What's going on? I thought I heard a gunshot. And we're there's fine. Krista. Well, at least she ran when she heard something. No one else did. We found some walkers. You and an eight-year-old versus three of them, huh? Wasn't the smartest decision. It just happened. It was stupid. You think? I'm not gonna say it was stupid. Like it was stupid. Trying to teach her how to take care of herself. We're getting used to working together. I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. That's a good idea. I hope you know what you're doing with her. Yeah, so do I. Me too. For her sake. I feel like I do because we're still living. You sure but okay? yeah, I'm a little right shaky. now it's it'll pass. Kind of hard to learn how to work together when we just are starting. We got it. I hope Let's go outside okay. now. she says she's what shaky. I'm not ready for a gun. No, nah, everything is no, dangerous. Sir. We learned that everything we always got to be alert. Do is dangerous. We'll get better, smarter, and faster. Okay. Okay. All right. Let's go back and. Get this train cut down. Maybe talk to Chris to explain what happened at the station, because that really wasn't a good situation, and that really was a stupid idea. That shouldn't. Have I even found happened. a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. I right, bet I'll see you in a few. But first, I gotta talk to Chris and explain. What happened? Right, girls. I don't want her to feel like hey. I don't know what I'm doing. We were trying to get used to being on our own, Clementine and I. 
Perhaps you take her into a dark, boarded-up building to build character. Not exactly. I think it's a good idea, figuring stuff out for yourself, for what it's worth. But be smart about it, though, you know? Teach her to scan the area for things. You two should never I'll be give you the, the benefit spot. of the doubt on knowing the basics the of survival of in this like world. Building there. But Especially the key factor of survival is also down. having numbers. You're, you and Omi surviving by yourself is living not going to work dead. forever. That will eventually that come back. Work. And Omega and I are still alive because we're two, not six, or eight, or ten. I don't believe in strength in numbers, and you shouldn't either. Alright everybody, that's all the time I got for today. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notifications bell down below to be informed of my new videos. I hope you guys are enjoying the series so far. I know I am. And with that being said, Walkie Talk Games, signing off.